first time, Paul, in my entire career that I ever was met with unemployment. And for me, it didn't last for one month, for two months, for three months. It lasted for 18 months. You, you know, you're not alone. I've heard this before, even with 2008, when the housing bubble, uh, when the economy took a little, um, another shit kicker in, 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 in 2008. But I, I want to ask you something about 18 months of feeling. What did you feel as a human being? And now maybe, does it, did it play a part on you? Because it did on me when I could not, or was not able to find what I was looking for for a long period of time. Did it weigh on you being a black man, an African man, or just a man, or just a human being? Or where there's different levels that woven inside all that. Because where you are now has a lot to do with those 18 months. Well, absolutely. It impacted me in every dimension that you can think of. Because here's, here's what was uncanny about that entire process. If you were going to bet on anybody being able to find a job after being unemployed, I was probably a good candidate to bet on. Okay. I worked for two of the big six accounting firms, KPMG and Ernst & Young. I graduated at the top of my class. I had excelled in my profession. I had multiple licenses as a certified public accountant, right. certified financial planner, distinguished resume, yet I could not pay somebody <laughs> to hire me after having been unemployed. What in the world is all that about? Right. right. So here's where the epiphany came in. Okay. There's a, there's a story in the Bible about God giving very specific directions to Jonah to go to Nineveh and do this. Yes. So Jonah refuted, refused, and got stuck in the belly, you know, in a whale's belly for right. three days, right? And so in looking back, what I recognized goes back to what I said about you're either designed for corporate or you're designed to be an entrepreneur. God knew that I would always refute, refuse the purpose and destiny that he had for my life in entrepreneurship because of the comfortability of being an employee. And so what he did was he literally shut every door that I could open back to being reemployed in that 18 months to make a point. Your purpose and your destiny is not in corporate. You know, I, hey, Ike, I.